Hey, I'm Cher, and welcome to Readings. We're doing premonitions for the month of July. Thank you, Spirit. And we're doing Libra. Hello, my darlings. For the month of July. I'm doing all playing cards. It's what I read best. Let spirit speak. Libra, I'm going to start off with your career. Immediately the work card comes out. Be careful of any dealings of love. You're about to meet somebody at your job. Wait. This is a noble person, male or female. This is someone who is strong. This is someone who has a great deal of love. On the board, Taurus, Gemini, Pisces, Aquarius. This is someone that you're going to want to stand at crossroads with and maybe take a chance. What do I say you should do? No. I think if you want to go out on a date, go out on a date. I would be very careful about moving quickly with this person. Not that they're a bad person, no. But they carry a lot of baggage. Their mind is full. And I mean packed full. They got a lot of shit going down. But they got a lot of love. They got a lot of strength, which is what keeps them going. Possibility of three children. Possibility of two marriages, children and both. The ex is immediately coming up here. And we've gone into a love reading here when I want your career, but immediately I've got love and career kind of mixing together. This person's ex. Whew, don't want to meet this one. You do not want to meet this one. I have it as a female, but it could be male or female. Your employment, your career, spirit, career, your career, wow, is this the boss that you're messing with? It's a boss that might be hitting on you. If it's not the boss, then it could be a, an assistant or someone that's a little bit higher than you. Someone that's got money. A lot of friggin' damage. Be very, very careful here, Libra. Do not take a leap with this person. Be very careful. Be careful how you word things around them. They do have a big heart, or they appear to, but they also got a hell of a lot of strength. They got a lot of pull from where they are. If this is someone, if you're working remote, this is someone you could be meeting online. But this person is definitely coming towards you in July. Be very careful. Remember the words of spirit. Be very careful. Go in real slow. Take flashlight. You'll notice certain ways that they talk to other people. Let that be a freaking red flag to you. Um, Sagittarius is here, Aries. I think I already told you about the rest. Pisces, uh, Taurus, Gemini, uh, Aquarius, and Libra. Okay. Um, be very careful because somehow this is mixing in with your employment, with your career. So you could be online, you could be working from home. If not, there's someone that's going to walk through those doors. 
there's someone that you're going to meet. So be careful. Uh, they've already seemed to have been married twice. Children on both sides. The ex. Wow. The ex. You don't want to meet that one. And, um, <clears throat> wow. Let me just uh, see if I can pick up something more about your career. <clears throat> This is someone who can tell you whether you're going to make it or break it. All of a sudden, I don't like this person. I don't like this person at all. This is a higher up of sorts. This, this is someone, if you went out on a date with them, they'd be like, you know what, I can help you get that other job that you want. It's a goddamn friggin' psychopath is what this is. Say no. Be nice. Make up a lie. Oh, I'm sorry, but I'm seeing somebody. And, and it's going good, but thank you so much. I, I really am flattered. Don't get involved with this person. This is a warning. Don't get involved with this person. And if you are seeing somebody, don't be all giggly around them and, and all shy and giggly. If you're a woman or if you're a guy, being all, you know, mm, look at me. No. You don't want to play with this individual. Let's go into your love life. Dear God, Spirit is strong today, and Spirit is sending the message out and talking to somebody out there. Pay attention. Be aware. Your love. Your love life has been, oh, it's just, you've gone through a tower. It's been very, very sad, but the truth is, the, the truth is, is that there is a love coming towards you in July. I'm not talking about somebody who wants to get into your bed or somebody making great promises. There is a true love coming towards you in July. The thing is, is... <clears throat> This person also has damages from the past, but shit, who doesn't? I mean, it's not a monk. It, everybody has damage from the past. Everybody is carrying scars. But this is someone who is ready to rebuild. Probably much like you. Ready to rebuild. This is somebody who... Um, well, they actually bring flowers and gifts. Wow. That's very rare to find nowadays. Okay, so I have the leap and the new beginning in the reverse. Now, as I can read this, <coughs> excuse me, I can read this as, oh, well, they, they just want to date. They, they don't want a new beginning. They, they don't want to leap into a relationship. This is somebody. I like them. I like them. I would date this person. Because this is someone who knows that they're carrying stuff. Hello? Visitors. This is someone who's carrying stuff, and this is someone who knows they still have to heal from past things. Is this someone who doesn't want to take a leap? Is this someone who doesn't want to start a new beginning with you? No. This is someone who wants to go slow. Because they want to make sure that they're healed 
and taking small steps towards you and you taking small steps towards them will end up being a very beautiful thing. This is in someone who is not in a big rush. This is someone who wants to make sure of this time. Libra. Oh, Ten of Cups. <laughs> well, I can see that this person was probably a thief in the past. But that's past. I have to ask myself, what did I used to be in the past? Oh, my Lord. This is someone who has money. This is someone who has love to give. This is someone who has emotion to give. Has joy to give. They're not afraid to spend money. They're not going to ravish you with gifts because they're not that type of person. But it is someone who does bring gifts. For example, if you invite them over for dinner, they'll bring a salad or a bottle of wine or both. They bring gifts. They don't just come over and just flop down and say, where's dinner? This is someone who is very, very thoughtful towards the other. So there is new love coming. Watch out for the one at work. Be nice. Lie through your teeth if you have to. Tell them you're seeing somebody. Have nothing to do with that person. Because they won't make promises. I can give you a higher position. <laughs> no, 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 no. They leave a trail of disaster behind them. But there is someone new coming in. That's the one. Go slow. They'll go slow. Pisces. Aries. Aries all over the board. Maybe an Aries. Taurus, Sedge, Capricorn, Gemini. These are the signs that are prominent in the reading. Libra, let's go into your health. Your health. Libra. Your health. Um, you're pretty freaking good. You're pretty good, darling. Minor aches and pains, headaches. Um, maybe arthritis. Don't really see anything that is like really mind and soul crushing. I do see, unfortunately, and I hate to see this, this, things like this bother, sure. But what I'm saying is that you're not in spirit. You, you need more spirit. You need more spiritual enlightenment and teaching and and more within time because you're very much a person of the world what's happening in the world is happening to me no it's not what's happening in the world has absolutely nothing to do with you because your life is bliss on the inside only you can make it worse and looking at the world makes it worse i do see that there are things that go awry and I see that you get upset about things that go awry like ah friggin gas prices are ridiculous and getting upset about it somebody kicked my car or you know someone threw a ball and broke my window and, and instead of just saying you know well I'm not gonna replace that window but going to the freaking uh, extremes 
maybe even going around and telling other people. Well, you know what they did to my window? You know someone kicked my damn car? And, and, and just carrying it on and, and causing the drama and letting things build up much more than what they are. If you can breathe through it, try. Try so hard. Okay. Now that just happened. Breathe through it. It is what it is. And you will see it change. Trust me. Don't fight against it because I got the Ten of Cups and I got you fighting against the Ten of Cups. So where things could be a hidden blessing, you don't see it as a hidden blessing. So why am I stuck in this friggin' traffic jam and, and this damn city and these damn people and blah 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 and making a big friggin' commotion and a bunch of drama out of something that can't be changed? Spirit's telling you to wait. To wait. Because there's a possibility here that, well, you're thinking about someone from the past, that's for sure. That could be someone that you have children with. Uh, but if not, it is definitely someone that you have a relationship in the past with. Doesn't have to be a lover. But I do see that you got yourself uh, really thinking about them, overthinking, as a matter of fact, about them. Um, all in all, it looks like there's not going to be a leap this month. And in saying that, I go right back to the love reading I just did. Uh, and the career reading. Yeah, don't take a leap there. The love reading, there is someone new coming in that wants to go real slow, so I don't see the leap. But it will come. Just uh, don't get yourself all, frustrate, <clears throat> all flustered and frustrated because I do see you have a tendency maybe once in a while, just once in a while, and going a little bit off the deep end over the, the small things that happen in life. And so, <laughs> God love you, darling. So, all in all, this is what I have in your reading. Everything really looks real good. But Spirit is definitely putting a warning out there. Someone that you will meet at work or online. Be very, very careful around this individual. Very good reading, all in all. And if you want to know, there's an Aquarius, a Libra. There's a Gemini. There's Aries. Pisces, um, Capricorn, Taurus. Okay. Thank you, Spirit. And thank you, Libra. I want to thank you so much, darlings, for coming out and joining me today. And, and if you like the way the Spirit reads, then please like and, and please share. But before you go, reach back and hit that subscribe button. And um, ring the bell. So you know the next time that Spirit and I are in the room to speak with you. Your friend says hello. I don't know who your friend is. But your friend says hello. Namaste. No